Hi everyone, Joel Wolfson here. I just tried a cool new pro adjustment from Topaz Labs that I wanted to preview for you because it's pretty impressive and should be able to save you a lot of time. It's called AI Clear and as the name implies the AI part is artificial intelligence and the clear part is aptly named because it does a few things that well clarify your images and in essence make them clear. You can read about how the artificial intelligence works on their website but basically it gives you a very fast equivalent to Topaz's wonderful denoise plugin, but without the learning curve and the time involved. So I threw kind of a difficult image at this thing to show you. Uh, this is the Seattle skyline, and right now we're looking at it at 100%. I shot it handheld at night, so a high ISO. And as you can see along the edges of these buildings in the sky, there's quite a bit of noise, both the color noise, which you see closer to the buildings, and up in the top part here, there's luminance noise. So we have the usual types of noise for a high ISO image. There's the overall view. I'm going to go over to adjustments over on the right here, and you'll see when I invoke this thing, AI Clear, right here, it will automatically zoom it to 100% so it allows you to see the noise and as the progress bar goes um, there we are so it cleared it up and you can see it still retained all the detail so really all I have left to do is some minor adjustments and if you notice over on the right here where that you see the controls the main control is this slider I found that strength of 90% which is what it defaults to works great you can always tweak that to the way you like it. If you like something better, you also have the opacity slider like you do on every layer. And then down on the bottom, I find these really convenient. It gives you exposure and clarity, which do what you would expect them to. The reason they're there is because AI Clear does evaluate everything that's been done to the image thus far. So if you have several layers, say basic adjustments or tone curves or whatever, um, it takes all that into account and then if you want to adjust it like in this case I think the image got just a tad too dark even with the adjustment so I'm gonna bump up the exposure a little bit that looks good and then I am gonna add some clarity too because that'll give it some contrast and it really adds to the amount of detail we see so even at a hundred percent you see here um, all that noise is gone and there's beautiful detail in the building. Uh, let me turn this off so we can see a before and after. So if I turn that off, there you are, you can see all the noise, both the color and luminance noise. Um, turn this on, no detail lost in the skyline, but we got rid of all that noise. Pretty darn cool, really fast, and you can also use this for batch processing. Uh, and what's really neat is it evaluates each image individually. So even if you have images that have great variance from one to the next, and even you can even be mixing, say, night scenes with day scenes, and some with a lot of noise and some with less noise, it doesn't really matter. This will evaluate it intelligently. Um, and you can't really do that with any other type of denoise plugin because it's just going to apply the parameters you have set. So. Um, not only does it save you time on individual images, but you can use it for batch processing too. To try it out, just make sure that you have the most up-to-date version of Studio. All the links and information you need are contained in this post. If you do decide to buy it, use my coupon code, which is jwolfson. That'll give you 15% off. This is about a $60 plug-in, so that gives you $9 off. And I think it's really useful, uh, not a lot of money to pay for something that can save you so much time. But of course, I'll leave that up to you. Give it a try. And I hope that you found this short video helpful. And we will see you next time. Thanks. Bye.